So Jock, have you enjoyed your morning down here watching down the lads training? <laughs> it's absolutely overwhelming. It's been great, Ralph. I never expected it really, you know. It's taken a long time, but you know, <laughs> but uh, especially they asked me to come for breakfast. Yeah, it's very special. That's 80 years. And I got a sausage party, I can't believe it. You know, <laughs> 80, you know, the, it's been really, really good. Uh, you know, in the way they've looked after me, the way they've been so, pl you know, what I can. And they treated me very well, they looked after me, Lee. Because I've known him uh, yeah. 20 odd years, you know, as a young kid. Like some of the players themselves, before they ever come here, I knew them. How long have you been following the Wolves in the day? 80 years? 80, say? easily, 80. easy. You see, it was a. I was adopted, you see, because I had no family. And they, it was a sister at Warrington General Hospital. And she adopted me. And she, that's where I learned all my medical science. She taught me a lot, you know. And then the, there was a doctor not far from us. He was an American doctor and he says, can I take your lad to a ball game? And they lived in Meeting Lane then. So, of course, he, he thought, well, Burton Wood. Yeah. Didn't yeah. he Burton yeah. Wood for a you know, basketball thing? He took me to Wooderspool. And the never days look, look never, since. ever. <laughs> and them days, you know, not like today. Played on well, Saturdays, Saturdays only. Yeah. No other time, so. And the, I remember Ken Curley, he was doing a job on the roofs in Wellfield Street. And he shouted down, Jock! God, we're playing at 23, I've got to be <laughs> down there. And you know, part time as they were and bitter cold, you know. Who, who would you but, say your favourite players that you've watched over the years then? Oh, the favourite, I think we'll have to start with the, the great Brian Bevan. Oh, of course, yeah. And then came the bit mature, it was Les Boyd, the, 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 Aussies, the Australian ones. And the. Uh, Oh, there's such a few a lot in the year. They were all great, really, you know, yeah. but there was one or two that were outstanding. I like John Woods, came yeah. from Lee. He was a very good goal kicker. But near the end, when he got fed up, he started missing goals, so he could go back to, <laughs> go back to Lee. Yeah. And then there was Tommy Martin. Yeah. They both were from Lee. Tommy was a great second row forward. And then there's big Jack Arkwright. He was a character, wasn't he? You know, but I think we've been so young, I've never known anything other sports, you see. Yeah. But I always lived in that Sankey and so for years I watched uh, a lot of players mature at Crossfields. Crossfields, you know, because I lived near Hood Lane area. Yeah. <coughs> but I've never regretted it, you know. I'll, uh, it's my life, I've, you know. I won't skip to work on the ambulance. In them days, you used to be in the pink and you get a pound if you're caught in the pink. And I told them I wasn't well. There was a cup match down here. Because oh. when I go <laughs> in on a Monday, <laughs> the lad says, Jock, what are you doing here? You've got a bad back. I went, oh. I'd won a pound. You see, in the, the evening pink in Manchester, you know. I did anything to him, you know, so I wouldn't miss. And what would you say has been your favourite game over the years? If you can pick pick one, oh, <laughs> if one, that's possible. One very, very, very special, I've got to say, was Odsel. When we, we played Halifax, then we had to have a, a replay at Odsel. Um, yeah. A hundred odd thousand. Yes. And believe you me, I couldn't even get out the coach. Could you not? I didn't even see it. Really? It was, honestly, and it was thousands outside. And it was Halifax Road on a Wednesday, and they were road repairing. You know, I've got hundred or thousand. But uh, when I would seen a bit of a replay or something, Jerry, Jerry Ellum scored a winning try. Don't meet somebody, in, you know. But undoubtedly, you know. I've seen some great games, I've got to admit, you know, especially at Walters Bowl. Tell us a little bit about this jumper that you're wearing. Oh, yes, that's my little yeah. darling knitted for me. When it was, I forget who we were playing, we were playing somebody. 
physician and it your little jumper. It's 66 years now. Wow, it's and it's never really I know well, it? I've never ever spoiled it and because I always had it hanging on the wall, you see. But it's very unique because that was the symbol thing, you know. Yeah. I was going to hand it into the foundation, you know, so the kid could put it in the thing, yeah. but uh, I don't know. Some great memories with that drum first, I suppose, aren't they? And my darling wife, she was with me all the time when I married. Married on Valentine's Day. Oh, Got a beautiful, beautiful picture from the Queen, yeah. a telegram, and she wrote me a very personal letter. But a lot never got because when I got married, you see, she also became the Queen of England the same time and the same day as I got married. That's why I get a person. A lot of people get married on that year, but not yeah. the same not time, same you know. Ah, they've got a big picture at home from her, you know. But she minuted that, Cynthia, and bless her, she's still in a nursing home, you know. Definitely proud of the primrose and blue colours, aren't you? Oh my God. Through and through. Aye. Great memories. Great memories. Yeah. As they say, in my shirt underneath, you'll never find another me. No. <laughs> I wouldn't want to. Yeah. That's no, only one. Great part of this club. Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, it's all the just I'm just telling Lee today. I've been to rough places, Workington and Barrow, yeah. water <laughs> sheddings. Halifax, go over the Pennines and then blow me thick fog, couldn't get home till the following day and, and because my darling wife was fit then we always went together. Yeah. Had the coach's windows broke many a time, you know. But there's always that rivalry with Ho and Ho Ki Ahi, wasn't there? Salford used to be another lot, you know. But I've enjoyed every minute, eh? there's no shoe, you know, I really have.